win the election. But the map is even more favorable to Donald Trump if you look through this. New polling today, it's a small lead, but, it, but Donald Trump is leading in Pennsylvania right now. Uh, Donald Trump is leading in Wisconsin right now. Uh, Donald Trump is leading in Arizona right now. And Donald Trump, most believe, is right now has the lead in Nebraska, too. That gets Donald Trump to 303. And there's new polling today that shows the president's approval rating in these battleground states is below 40. The president's ballot number right now is below 40 in most of those states, and it's at 42 in Nevada. It's very hard in 16 weeks, we count the votes 16 weeks from tonight, to turn that around. Plus, Democrats are now worried. They think, I'm not saying this is going to happen, but what they're saying is the president's going to have to spend more time and more resources on places like Virginia because it's competitive, on places like New Hampshire because it's competitive. You look at this map as it plays out, and there are Democrats making the case, and we have Wisconsin blue here. Let's move Wisconsin over here. There are Democrats making the case that Donald Trump is on a viable path as of today to get to 330 electoral votes, Wolf, or even higher. Wow. 300, this is CNN. And remember, uh, these projections, many of them are being done, they average in the polls from these different states. Many of the polls that they're using are polls prior to the Democrat donor's assassination attempt on President Trump. This is, I mean, this is just amazing. Higher, because they see other states in here. The Trump campaign says Minnesota. The Trump campaign says maybe New Mexico. Let's be cautious. Those are blue states traditionally. But the president's standing, his approval rating, his ballot number, people's views about how old he is, and people who view people who view the state of the economy are very bad for the president right now. And so even if you just go back to where we start, Donald Trump is in command. The numbers are getting worse for the president, Wolf. And Donald Trump has an opportunity with this convention to... Build it even more.